Hello everybody, welcome to DD-153. DD-153 will also be difficult. One more difficult lesson than some easy stuff, okay? DD-153 is part of an interview with the famous American singer named Sarah Bareilles. She plays the piano and sings. She's very talented. But it's not easy. But we'll do that later. First, we need to go back to DD-152, which was very long, very difficult. It was about rescuing a dog. Let's listen again. A search party of seven, mostly strangers, headed out. When they found Missy, she'd been marooned on the mountain for eight days. Her paws were all torn up and bloody. and She seemed crippled. It seemed like it was basically over. Okay, let me read the answers to you. A search party of seven, mostly strangers, headed out. When they found Missy... She'd been marooned on the mountain for eight days. Her paws were all torn up and bloody. She seemed crippled. It seemed like it was basically over. All right, let's go to the top here. Uh, now, first of all, difficult words, search party, missy, marooned, pause, torn up, and I have to change colors, uh, crippled. These are some difficult words, so let's start at the top. A search party of seven. That doesn't mean a party! No, no. Another definition of party is a group of people. So sometimes when you make a reservation at a restaurant, the manager will say, how many in your party? How many in your party? How many people do you want to reserve a table for? There are three people in my party. There will be three people in my party. There will be three people sitting at the table. Okay, so party can also mean a group of people. A search party, a group of people who got together to search for the dog. There was a dog, okay? A search party of seven. Seven people got together to search for the dog, to get the dog, to rescue the dog. Mostly strangers. These seven people didn't really know each other. Most of them met for the first time. Hi, my name is Bill. Hi, my name is John. Let's go rescue the dog. Okay? Mostly strangers. So a search party of seven. Mostly strangers headed out. Headed out. This is a two-word verb. Instead of headed out, we could say took off. Took off. And this just means left. So instead of took off, we could just say left. Departed. They went up the mountain. So a search party of seven, mostly strangers. This S cancels the T. Mostly strangers headed out. Headed out. I'm heading out. Bye-bye. So when you leave the office, you can say... I'm heading out. Bye-bye. See you tomorrow. Heading out. Leaving. When they found Missy, these seven people, they, the search party, when they found Missy. Now, Missy is the name of the dog. Yeah, that was a tough one. Messy? No, not messy. Missy, the name of the dog. So we use a capital M. When they found Missy, she had been marooned. She'd been marooned. Oh, this is tough. This is had, of course. Grammar, grammar had been. She'd been. 
She'd been, she'd been marooned. Marooned. What does it mean to be marooned? To be marooned, to be left alone. She'd been left alone. She'd been abandoned. She'd been abandoned. So she had an owner, but the owner left her there. He just left her and forgot about her. What a terrible guy. When they found Missy, she'd been marooned on the mountain for eight days. No water, no food, injured. That's terrible. Who is this guy? Who marooned her? The next guy, an interview. Her paws. Her paws were all torn up and bloody. Her paws. What are paws? I'll show you. Where is my paw? <gasps> my paw is missing. Oh my goodness. I had a paw, but I don't see it anymore. How can my paw be missing? Ah, uh, here we go. Arr. This is a paw. Can you see what this is? Yeah, it's it's like the the foot or the hand of a dog or a bear or a cat. They don't have hands. They don't have feet. They have paws. So this is a paw. Sorry. Why do I have a paw? Yeah, sorry. Yes, I have a paw. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, her paws. Missy. Missy is a girl's name, so it's a female dog. So her paws. She, her, her paws were all, in this case, all means completely. Completely. Or totally torn up. What does torn up mean? That's also a two-word verb, a phrasal verb. Torn up means cut. Cut. So it's a mountain. There are stones, and her paws had cuts everywhere. Oh, so she, she can't walk. It hurts so much to walk. Her paws were all cut up, all torn up. It's terrible. And bloody. Of course, if the paws are cut, they will be bloody. Wow, that must have really hurt. The next guy. She seemed crippled. What does crippled mean? Another word for crippled could be lame. Or basically injured or hurt, especially the limbs, like the arms or the legs, when it's broken or you can't move or your, your leg hurts and, and you walk like this. This would be crippled. I'm crippled. Something happened. A lot of soldiers and victims from car accidents and wars, they end up crippled. It's terrible. Disabled. Uh, not fully functioning. She seemed crippled. Like maybe her arm was broken or her leg was broken. It seemed like it was basically over. What does that mean? What are all these it's? It. It seemed like. This it, the situation, the prognosis. I'll write this down. Prognosis. The prognosis, uh, the situation. Oh, I see a mosquito. The situation. The situation when we found her and she was crippled. The situation seemed like it, the prognosis, the situation, was basically over. What does that mean? There's a mosquito. Was basically with my blood. Uh. Yes, this is like a live class. Sorry. I hope that was my blood. What if it was somebody else's blood?
Ugh, I should wash my hands. Anyway, uh, it seemed like, sorry, it seemed like it was basically over. It seemed like the situation was done. That the dog would die. We thought it was over. The future of the dog was over. The prognosis was over. Prognosis. The final outcome, the ending result was over. And in this case, over means death. Dead. But Missy is okay. She's okay. And uh, she has a new home. And the guy who marooned her, he might have a problem in court. I hope he does. That guy, how can you maroon a dog? That's pretty evil. Anyway, this was very difficult. Let's read it again together. Are you ready? A search party of seven, mostly strangers, headed out. When they found Missy, she'd been marooned on the mountain for eight days. Her paws were all torn up and bloody. She seemed crippled. It seemed like it was basically over. Should I say it quickly? You want to try it with me? A search party of seven, mostly strangers, headed out. When they found Missy, she'd been marooned on the mountain for eight days. Her paws were all torn up and bloody. She seemed crippled. It seemed like it was basically over. Not easy. You guys, but you, you did a great job. Listen again, and then we'll move on to the next Daily Dictation. A search party of seven, mostly strangers, headed out. When they found Missy, she'd been marooned on the mountain for eight days. Her paws were all torn up and bloody. and She seemed crippled. It seemed like it was basically over. A search party of seven, mostly strangers, headed out. When they found Missy, she'd been marooned on the mountain for eight days. Her paws were all torn up and bloody. and She seemed crippled. It seemed like it was basically over. Okay, I washed my hands. The mosquito is gone. Now, DD-153 is an interview from Sarah Bareilles. She's a pretty famous pianist and singer, a pop singer. Uh, Sarah is talking about what she wanted to be when she was very young. Good luck on the dictation. It's not that easy. The words are actually easy, but her pronunciation is terrible. She's mumbling. But for an American, for a native English speaker, it's okay. We can understand. So good luck, and uh, I hope you do well. I've got to say hello to our new subscribers. I'll do that at the end. And also, our first live lecture will be probably tomorrow night. I'll talk about that later, too. Good luck, and I'll say hi to the new people right after you do the dictation. There was a time where I was really obsessed with animals and I wanted to be um, like a dolphin trainer. But I don't know if I would have been able to do that because I'm kind of scared of the water. <laughs> There was a time where I was really obsessed with animals and I wanted to be um, like a dolphin trainer. But I don't know if I would have been able to do that because I'm kind of scared of the water. <laughs> There was a time where I was really obsessed with animals and I wanted to be um, like a dolphin trainer. But I don't know if I would have been able to do that because I'm kind of scared of the water. <laughs> there was a time where I was really obsessed with animals and I wanted to be um, like a dolphin trainer. But I don't know if I would have been able to do that because I'm kind of scared of the water. <laughs> Okay, it's time to say hello to our new subscribers. We have a bunch. 
Wuj W N W G W U G W U G E W N Wujun Wujun Thank you Ungur He Ungur He Ungur He Thank you very much Yak Zone Five Yak Zone Is it Yak Zone or Yak Zone Yak Zone Five Thank you very much for joining Walid Ali Walid Is it Walid Ali Thank you May I say Shokran? Police 5559. Police 5559. The police are here. Oh no! Run! Ah! No, I'm not running. I, I just got more people. Uh, hold on a second. Uh, da -da -da -da, go down to the bottom. Beatrice 19734. Beatrice 1973. April? Maybe. Welcome, Beatrice. QKR2431. Cooker. Cooker2431. Thank you for joining. Katrin Salt. Katrin. Is it Katrin? Katrin Salt. Thank you for joining my channel. The I Wanna Be Sedated. Ah, yes. Good music. I Wanna Be Sedated. Are you talking about Pink Floyd? Or is it Green Day? Or is it Nirvana? Who says that? I want to be sedated. I forgot. But welcome. I hope you're awake. I hope you are awake. The I want to be sedated. Then we have Super KDK. Super KDK. Welcome, Super. Spy 26666 SPI. Spy. Spy 26666. Welcome to the channel. Kwang 51, Kwang 51, hello Kwang, welcome. Hello Bello 2010, I've said hello to you before, hello Bello 2010, thanks a lot for joining again. Zhuang Nguyen, Zhuang Nguyen, I hope my pronunciation is okay. Zhuang Nguyen, thank you very much for joining my channel. Say Dems, Say Dems, Say Dems, is that correct? Say Dems, thank you. Oh, we've got some Chinese characters. Let me check. Ming Hai Zheng. Ming Hai Zheng. Ming Hai Zheng. Ming Hai Zheng. Thank you very much, Ming Hai Zheng. Xie Xie. From Taiwan, thank you for joining my channel, Ming Hai Zheng. Thank you. And, oops, oh no, I lost my page. And then we've got a couple of more. Just Uncle Bob. Just Uncle Bob. Now, I've said hi to this guy too, I think, but Just Uncle Bob, welcome back. The Giaco 1975, G I A C O. Is it Giaco or Giaco? The Giaco 1975. Thank you. Soul Free. It's a lot of E's. Soul Free. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Sophie Chan X. Sophie Chan X. Is it Chan X or Chanks? Sophie, welcome to Daily Dictation. J Korea 180. J Korea, thanks a lot for joining. Liu Zhang He 520. Is that right? Liu Zhang He 520. Thank you very much for joining Daily Dictation. Gute Che. Che Gute. Che Gute, welcome to my channel. Ilhama 19. Ilhama 19. Welcome to Daily Dictation. Kira Mail. Kira Mail. Kira Mail 17. Thanks a lot. Hope Fly Full. Hopefully Full? <laughs> Maybe you want to say Hopefully Full? Hopefully Full? Or is it Hope Fly Full? Hope Fly Full. Welcome to my channel. Then we have Roka 77. Roka 77. Welcome to Daily Dictation. And we've got some more. After Roka 77, we've got Bin Nguyen Trong. Bin Nguyen Trong. Welcome, Bin Nguyen Trong. Gam Ung. E. Entire. Entire. Entire has joined my channel. Entire. Uh, all. Your middle name is All. Welcome. Ultra Sam. Ooh. Ooh, no, no, no. Ulra, Ulra, is it U L R A? Ulra Sam, Ulra Sam, Ulra Sam, Ulra Sam, Ulra Sam, welcome to my channel. 
Wilder's Eye. Wilder's Eye. Thanks a lot for joining Daily Dictation. K.S. Juni. Is it Juni or Juni? Juni. K.S. Juni. Thank you very much. Super Pack. Is it Super Pack or Super Pack? Thank you for joining Daily Dictation. Lots of supers. And then we got Rich Beck. Rich as in you're very rich and I am very poor. Or rich as in Richard, King Richard the Lionhearted. Hmm. Rich Beck, welcome to the channel. Elven football. Elven football. Is that football with elves? Or is that... What kind of football? Is it football as in American football or American soccer? I know. The whole world says football. Only America says America. I know. But I'm American. Please understand. American football is cool, too. I like it. It's really cool. I like soccer, too. Welcome, Elven Football. Then we have Happy Nobleman. Oh, a happy nobleman. Not a sad nobleman. Probably a rich nobleman. And also a happy nobleman. Thank you. Then we have Nova Hora. Nova Hora. Nova Hora. Thank you very much for joining my channel. We got a couple more after Nova Hora. Angela Salvato, Angela Salvato, Angela Salvato, thank you very much, Angela. Shira Chang, Shira Chang, Shira Chang, thank you for joining my channel. Esther0714, Esther0714, thanks a lot. Manije Hushmandan, Manije, is it Hush or Haush? How, house, Haushmandan, Hushmandan. Manije. Manije, thank you very much for joining Daily Dictation. LW681217. Oh, is your birthday December 17th? That's great. My birthday is December 22nd. Nice to meet you, LW. Then we have Ahmed Fadil. F A D L. How do I pronounce that? Fadil? Fadil? Is that correct? I hope so. Ahmed Fadil? Shokran. Thank you very much for joining my channel. Ufapa. Ufapa. That's a cool name. I like that. Ufapa. U-F-A-P-A. -A. Ufapa. Welcome to my channel. Mr. Vinezapnost. Mr. Vinezapnost. Vinezapnost. Thank you for joining my channel. 1945 Dimitris. 1945 Dimitris. Dimitris. That's a Good name, too. Dimitris. My name is Dimitris. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. Then we have He Song Jong. Jong He Song. Thank you very much for joining my channel, He Song. And we got a couple more. Almost done. Almost done. Ah, just one more. JJ Hyun Woo. Hyun Woo. JJ Hyun Woo. Hyun Woo. Thank you very much for joining, too. Everybody, thank you for joining Daily Dictation. You joining my channel makes me very happy. Let's keep making the channel bigger and better. Share my video on Facebook and Twitter and Google+. And remember, tomorrow night, now this will be, what is the date? I don't even know the date. Uh, do I have a calendar? Oh, I don't even have a mouse. There we go. Oh, hold on a second. My system is very slow. I got too many programs on here. Aww. Okay, August 23rd, August 24th, August 24th, 2012, at 11 p.m. South Korea time. So this is Friday night, August 24th. 11 p.m. South Korea time, please join my live class. I'll be doing a live lecture, uh, and hopefully many of you can join me. Um, it's live, but you have to join me on Google+. Plus. So Google+, Plus, you know about Google+. Plus. So please join my Google+. Plus. Go to Daily Dictation main channel page. Go to the main channel page and there I will uh, uh, have a Google Plus link on the right hand. Click that, 
join my Google Plus link and then uh, also follow me on Twitter and I will send a twit and I will start the lecture at 11 p.m. I'll do my best 11 p.m. on a Friday night. It will be my first live lecture so I'm a little bit nervous and hopefully it will work well. If you do not have a video camera or a microphone, that's okay. You can chat. There's live chatting, okay? If you have a video camera or and or a microphone, that's great. We can talk to each other, okay? So please join my lecture. Once again, you don't need a video camera. You don't need a microphone. You can just chat, okay? You can watch it. You can still watch it, okay? And hopefully many of you will join. Tell your friends and uh, let's have a good time. Uh, it's Friday night, so I will probably drink a beer as I'm teaching English. But don't worry, it will not be drunken English, I promise. <clears throat> yes, now I must go. So have a great evening. Good luck on the new dictation. Tell your friends to join, and I'll see you tomorrow night live. Bye-bye. This class was approved by T. Oh, I'm T.